Hello everybody, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to delete pending Windows updates, whereas if perhaps Windows updates frozen or it's stuck and you're just not getting any results, this tutorial will be for you. So we're going to jump right into it and we're going to begin by opening up the start menu just by left clicking on the start button one time. I'm going to type in services. Best match should come back with services here. I want to left click on that one time to open up the services window. Now you want to first locate the background intelligent transfer service. Double click on it. If service status says running, you want to left click on stop. Then you want to left click on OK. Now you want to scroll down to get to the Windows Update service. So again, Windows Update, double click on that. If server status is running, again, left click on stop. Notice we're not changing the actual startup type here. You can keep it wherever you had it as. Most people probably should have it in automatic mode, but right now we're just currently stopping the service so we can clear out the pending Windows updates because it won't let us if it's currently being used by the program, which should hopefully make some sense to you guys. So it's just going to take a moment here, it appears. And once that's done, I'm going to left click on OK. Close out the services window. Now you want to open up the start menu, type in File Explorer. Best match should say File Explorer here. I'm going to left click on that one time. Now you want to go and left click on this PC on the left side. Windows 7, Windows 8 might just say Computer. Just left click on that instead. And then Devices and Drivers, you want to go underneath your local disk where Windows is installed on. It should have a little Windows icon above the hard drive. You want to double click on that. And now you want to go underneath a Windows, so double click on the Windows folder. Scroll down until you get to the Software Distribution folder, so double click on that. Now you want to double click on the Download folder. And now every download listed in here you just want to delete, so just highlight over all of them. Or do Control A and then right click left click on delete or you can use your keyboard shortcut however you are more comfortable with deleting stuff this isn't actually deleting Windows updates that are installed on your computer this is merely where Windows updates go to become installed on your computer if that makes sense we're clearing the Windows update cache if we're going to be formal about it so if you're going to get any folder access denied you can always just do this for current items and then continue or if it says they're in use, you could just skip over them. The point is we're trying to clear most of them out of here, so that's what the main objective is. And once that is done, I would highly suggest you guys restart your computer and then attempt to engage in a Windows Update once again. And hopefully your issue should have been resolved at that time. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do I was able to help you out. And as always, thanks for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.